The Spark is hosted by the University of Oregon on May 17th. And what we're doing is we're basically showing the university community that clean cook stoves matter. And um, we're also going to be recruiting some new interns for the next term there. And a lot of that has to do with the stories of our current interns. They will go with me to career fairs and that sort of thing and talk about their experience to their fellow students. And that's what really matters. This is what the world cooks on, but typically it looks a lot bigger. Instead of these sticks, I want you to imagine tree trunks because that's what people cook on. They cook over open fires and they use really large wood. Really large wood produces a lot of heat and a lot of heat makes the pot really hot. The problem with heat transfer physics is that hot fire always wants to transfer the heat to the coolest area. But when you're cooking on a pot in an open flame, the pot's the warmest area so the heat escapes out the sides. What we have here is a stove that concentrates and focuses the heat. So this stove has been specifically designed to work with this pot. In here we have a chamber, a combustion chamber. It's a lot like a carburetor on a car. This takes the product of the fire and it turns them into gases that are combusted here in this chamber, directing all of the heat toward the base of the pot. The heat then spreads up the side of the pot so that the food or the contents of the pot are all cooked equally from the bottom and from the sides. The heat then escapes out the sides and we retain heat with this skirt right here. As the heat uh, as the air and the emissions cool down, they fall and they escape out this chimney. Now this chimney, by the time the emissions get to this point, this chimney is cool enough for people to touch without harm. One of the big problems with inefficient fires and cooking practices worldwide is that people injure themselves a lot because of the hot oil, hot water, hot contents of the pot. And so this system is completely safe for cooks, for children, and this stove is essentially tip-proof.